Oh man, we're getting our bake on. Can you believe we just <laughs> had Buddy Velastro on the line all the way from New York? The boss, yo. Doing his thing. I saw him baking a statue of Liberty cake the other day. How amazing is that? And he owned it. He owned that cake. Totally. Man. He is absolutely. insanely good, but it sounds like it's getting a little crazy outside, man. It is, it is. We we'll be keeping you up to date on our intense. baking action, man. But, um, you know, we always say dogs are a man's best friend. But it really, really rings true. I mean, we, we found some, some crazy stories about how dogs really became man's best friend, only friend to survival <laughs> at the time uh, in, in, in some epic survival stories. Really. Yeah, and it, it just makes you think how many of these stories have gone unheard throughout history. But we managed to unearth some incredible hero dog stories. We wanted to relate to you just to inspire Bob and Ben yeah. ahead of the weekend. As you, you can see, they need a little bit of it, hey? A little bit of inspiration. Yeah. So, so I tell you this, this, this yeah. one story. In Poland, right, um, an adopted stray dog, who is now a, a very big local hero yeah. in the town of uh, Zierwin in Poland, after it saved a three-year-old girl from freezing to death after getting lost in, in uh, the icy marshland. Now, after wandering out of her grandmother's house one evening, little Julia was unable to find her way back, and uh, rescue teams only Aww. managed to find her the next morning cold, wet, and crying. The little girl was still alive only because she had clung to the dog named Zaru for body heat. Now, the dog is the most important part of this story um, uh, as you know, he, is, he is her, in, in a way. And it is thanks to this dog that the girl survived the night, said the fireman, whose name I won't even try to pronounce. <laughs> yeah, good, good effort Thanks, yeah. <laughs> But her grandmother says that the little girl has obviously very happy to be safe and to be alive, um, that she can't go anywhere without that little dog now. It's like Rachel Do you remember Rachel Kee de Beer, man? Oh, oh, that is just too sweet, man. And we've got a lovely story coming out of England, a Jack Russell saving sure. its owner from burning to death. Barbie, love the name, a seven-year-old Jack Russell from Bristol in England was given a bravery award from the RSPCA after she managed to alert her owner that her bed was on fire. Now, Rosemary Field, 72 years old, which gives you an indication of why she wouldn't have known that the bed was on fire, wow. but, um, only partially sighted and was asleep in her bed in the early hours of the morning when the bedside lamp um, fell over and lit the side of her bed. Now Barbie, who was asleep nearby, sensed the danger and looked her owner's face in an effort to wake her up. When Rosemary woke up, she threw a jug of water over the flames to extinguish them before calling the fire brigade, who upon closer inspection informed Rosemary that Barbie had most definitely saved her life. And of course that smoke inhalation would have knocked her out exactly. long before she would yeah. have even known that the fire was going. Look at little what Barbie. What presence of mind, eh? Barbie, man, oh, what a start. Manus. In Canada, now, um, a border collie form, uh, from Toronto breaks out of house to save owner. That's the headline of the story there. Oh. Where a four-year-old border collie named Snickers saved the life of her owner, Gregory Gold, um, who suffers from a chronic condition which blocks his airways. Now, early one morning in 2012, a neighbor from Snickers pace, or saw Snickers pacing in the driveway and after uh, having broken down a barricade to get out into the owner's yard. So noticing that the dog was barking frantically and refusing to leave, the neighbor then called the police and when they broke through the dog's uh, dog house door, they found Mr. Gold um, lying on the floor having collapsed after the machine that supplied him with air had stopped working. And the dog stayed with the owner until the paramedics took him away. And thanks to the dog's efforts, the man survived to see wow, another day. She looks How like a sweetheart, eh? Hey? Look at that. Those <laughs> eyes are like, yeah, I did it, I did Just, it. I, I'll do it, I'll save it, I'll save it. it. No, very sweet. Then on our own continent, you know we've got our own African hero dogs. There was a farm dog rescuing a newborn baby in wow. Ghana. Now on the 8th of June last year, um, a young dog in Ghana was praised um, as a hero hound after saving the life of an abandoned two-week-old baby. That is unbelievable. Madam Rosemary Azur, Regional Director of Health in Ghana, told the Ghana News Agency that the dog reportedly found the baby under a bridge in the northern part of the country near the regional capital of Bolgata uh, Bolgatana. Rather than abandon the vulnerable tot, the dog curled up next to it for the night, refusing to leave its side. That is just ridiculous. Yeah. A search party um, who were actually looking for the dog, not the, the little baby, found the duo the next morning. The dog's owner had become worried that the pooch hadn't returned home and gotten a group together to look for the pup throughout um, the woods and the nearby fields. And they spotted the, the beautiful pup under the bridge and then saw that a baby was nuzzling into its fur for warmth. Are you kidding what, me? What do you think is it like in, in dogs, let's say particularly, that would have identified that kind of know, that mothering urgency? Instinct. Yeah, like I have to stay here, I can't go away and go hunting for food or do something else. You know, almost like the ultimate mother. It's almost like the, the human species has attracted the ultimate mothering gene towards us. But it is My goodness. so prevalent throughout history how dogs have been used to as yeah. surrogates for other animals yeah. and how often they come in to save a human being's life. So spare a thought for your hero <laughs> dog this morning. <laughs> Bob and Bella, you're destined you guys, for You guys great are things. our heroes in some other way. Hey? Even though you're sleeping right now, Bob and Bella, we love you guys, okay? We really do. Too okay. much.
All right, we're going to go to a quick ad break right now. <laughs> Lots more cooking and baking. And Notende is in the oh. studio. Unga <laughs> <laughs> He just keeps going. That's the strength you get from Bubtail. Bubtail, SA's most loved dog food for strong South African dogs.